security cameras with night vision. It's pretty important, right? When you're protecting your home, your family, and your stuff, lots of shady stuff happens at night, and you want that night vision to kick in on your security camera. Well, for the longest time, you could only get black and white night vision, which is called IR, infrared night vision. But slowly but surely, every brand known to man is coming out with color night vision, and that's very exciting. Now, each brand is starting to perfect it, and one brand in particular, Reolink, has night vision called ColorX, and they're pretty proud of it. And we're gonna see if it lives up to the hype. That's what we're talking about today. Let's get to it. What up, everybody? George Langebeer here. Yeah, today we're talking about Reolink's Color X Night Vision, and that's just their fancy name for color night vision. Now, Reolink has this Color X technology in some PoE cameras, which is power over Ethernet, best used with Reolink's NVRs, network video recorders. They also have a couple battery cameras that have Color X, and they also have a couple Wi Fi cameras that have Color X. Now, Reolink sent me some of their PoE models with Color X and I wanna thank them for sending me these cameras. I also wanna thank them for sponsoring this video. But when I'm talking about ColorX, you know I'm gonna tell you like it is. So again, I've got some of the PoE models when it comes to the ColorX line. I've got the CX810, the CX820, and the CX410C. Now they also have a fourth PoE model, which is just the CX410, very similar to the 410C with one minor difference, which we'll talk about. But again, I'm testing those three models. I'm gonna tell you the specs of those three models and all the similarities in specs and then also the differences in specs. I'm gonna talk about ColorX specifically and tell you whether or not I think it lives up to the hype because Reolink is very proud of it. Now, before I talk about those specs, I wanna talk about how Reolink achieves ColorX, color night vision. They use an F1.0 super aperture lens that's compared to a lot of cameras that have an F2.0 aperture lens. The F1.0 aperture lens lets in four times more light than the F2.0. And also we're using a one slash 1.8 inch sensor on these cameras. And that also helps achieve that color night vision. So when you're in those low light situations, the lens and the sensor is just letting in more light and that allows for the color. Moving on to those specs. First up, we have resolution. Now the CX810 and the CX820 both are 4K and the CX410C and the CX410, which I'll mention, they are both 2K resolution. They've all got that F1.0 super aperture lens. They've all got that true color night vision. We've got person, animal, and vehicle detection. We've got neighbor-friendly warm light. So these cameras get that color night vision using white lights. Most color night vision cameras do. Now, some people worry about their neighbors getting freaked out about these white lights. Well, Reolink makes it warm light, and they've actually got four different modes you can use. So you can kind of decrease the intensity of these lights so you don't freak anybody out. All three models here have two-way audio. And they've also got a double warning system, meaning that these cameras are active deterrent cameras. So you can use that white light to scare away an intruder. You can make it blink and stuff like that. And then you've also got a siren. You've got a built-in audible siren, so you can audibly scare away an intruder as well. Now, in addition to having people, vehicle, and animal detection, these cameras also have some smart detection features, which are really sweet. We've got virtual fence alerts. So if somebody hops your fence, you can be alerted. We've got zone intrusion alerts. So if somebody enters a restricted area, you can be alerted. And then we've also got zone linger alerts. So if somebody's just hanging out in your yard for too long, you can be alerted. All three are pretty cool. Now let's just talk about the installation of these cameras real quick. Now again, power over ethernet, meaning that I'm running an ethernet cable, in this case, CAT6, back to a Reolink NVR. And so you've got a cable from the camera back to the NVR. The NVR is controlling all three cameras. That's where your interface is, and that's kind of the brains of the operation. But that's how I'm currently testing these cameras. As far as storage options, mentioning that NVR, you can not only use the NVR, which has got a built-in hard drive and you can do different configurations, but you can also use these cameras as standalone cameras with a micro SD card up to 256 gigs. Now, both of those options are free and that's awesome. 
And then all three cameras we're testing here have an IP67 weather rating, so they're good in pretty much all climates and all conditions. All right, now let's talk about some of the differences in these three cameras. And again, we're talking about the PoE models in the Color X line. The CX820 and the CX810 are basically the same camera with different form factors. The CX820 is a turret dome, and the CX810 is a bullet camera. The CX810 and the CX820 both are 4K resolution with 25 frames per second as far as frame rate. And then field of view wise, they're 93 degrees horizontal, 48 degrees vertical. The CX410 bullet and the CX410C, which is what I'm testing, has 2K resolution with a max frame rate of 30 frames per second, field of view 89 degrees horizontal and 46 degrees vertical. So the 410 series has less field of view, less resolution, but higher frame rate. And then the 810s have higher resolution, wider field of view, but a little less on the frame rate. And when I'm talking about the CX410 that I'm not testing, basically the difference there is the CX410C, which is the one I have, also has IR night vision instead of just the Color X, whereas the CX410 does not. So that's just the main difference. So the 810 and the 820, they're just Color X. The 410's just Color X, but the 410C adds IR night vision as well, which would be black and white. So if you don't wanna freak out your neighbors with your white light, you've got that IR option on the 410C. All right, now let's talk price. The CX820 is currently $119.99. The CX810 is normally $109.99, currently on sale for $87.99. The CX410C is $74.99 normally, on sale for $71.24. And then the CX410 is normally $89.99, on sale for $76.49. Go ahead and check in the description of this video for the affiliate link. You can see the current price and purchase if you so desire. Now I keep mentioning that these are the PoE models in the Color X line, but they also have two Wi-Fi cameras. They've got the CX410W, and the E1 Outdoor CX. And then they also have some battery models, which I've mentioned in several of my videos because I use these two cameras. They've got the Argus 4 Pro and the Altus PT Ultra. So go back and check out videos that I've done on those cameras. So what are my thoughts on these cameras and specifically Color X? Let's start with the cameras. I think it's cool that the 820 and the 810 are both 4K and even the 410C and 410 at 2K, still very decent resolution. The new smart detection features are pretty cool, like the jumping over the fence and the lingering. That's all pretty sweet. Always great to have multiple storage options and free storage options, meaning no monthly fee. We've got good weather ratings on these three cameras we're testing. And it's nice that these cameras are active deterrent cameras. I say it all the time. My favorite thing about security cameras is they're proactive. You're stopping things before they happen. And that active deterrent helps get that done. Now, these cameras, which one would I prefer? I think I would go with the CX820 because I'm always a turret camera guy. If you watch my videos, you know this. They're a little more vandal proof. They're a little more recessed so you get more angle. There's just some benefits to the turret. So that's my favorite. All right, let's talk about what I think about ColorX specifically. Now, please understand I'm a professional camera installer. I own Silver Hammer Surveillance. I've been doing this for 20 years. So I have a very high standard when it comes to security cameras. And I'm all about professional grade. If you call me on the phone, I'm gonna recommend something professional grade like Alibi Security. You just got the top-notch build quality, top-notch features, top-notch night vision. But there is a sweet spot between the cheap crap and the drug dealer cameras and then professional grade. And there's two brands that own that sweet spot. It's Reolink and Unify. But here's the deal. Let's talk about Unify for a second. They are just so known for their network. Top-notch networking, can't be beat there. Then they also offer cameras with their Unify Protect. Now you have to be careful with Unify because they have some enterprise models, enterprise meaning professional grade, but a lot of their models are not. In fact, with some of their cameras, you have to get a special attachment to achieve color night vision. And what sometimes pisses me off about Unify is they market themselves as professional grade everything and their cameras, that's not the case. You have to get their enterprise models. So you have to be careful with their hardware because software top notch including their Unify Protect software. But hardware, be careful, because you might have to buy an extra attachment for color night vision. Reolink, not like that. They don't blow smoke up your butt. They tell you like it is, they know their market, and they've got this ColorX built into the cameras. You don't have to buy a special attachment. 
So when it comes to the budget level option in between the crap and the professional grade, and you're talking about night vision specifically, I say Color X is where it's at. All right, there you go. That's Reeling's Color Night Vision called Color X. We were talking today specifically about their PUE models. What do you think? I can just hear and read the comments now from all the Unify snobs out there. Gonna be pissed about what I just said, but it is what it is. Bring it on. But Reeling, good job. I mean, at this price point, that Color Night Vision can't be beat. So considering where you were before, again, I wasn't a fan to where you are now, where I am a fan, very nice. If you are on a budget and you need a good color night vision camera, check these out. I appreciate your support very much. Whether you're past, present, or future subscribers, I love you all. And it means the world to me that you're watching. So thank you. And until the next video, peace and love, my friends.